Hey everyone, it's Leo with the Dreaming Tree, and today we're gonna put together a new freebie. It's our Pilgrim Hat Treat slash uh, place setting project. And as you can see here, I have a special guest with me. And what is your name, miss? Gabby. Gabby, okay. A um, little background, Gabby is my girlfriend's daughter who I've had the pleasure of raising now for, how long have you lived here with me? <laughs> About three years, yeah. So anyway, um, she's actually quite the artist, and we've done some paper piecing stuff before. We worked on a project. What did we work on before? What did we make together? I forgot. You forgot? We made Valentine's for your class, remember? Remember when we had that? I had that bottle, and I was squeezing so hard, and it shot out like crazy? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so she's gonna join me today in making this project, and we're gonna do some inking. Have you ever done some inking? No, okay. All right, well, you're gonna do some inking today. So, um, as you can see, here is, oh, that's right. She actually, as I mentioned, she is quite the artist. So you can actually show them here, or you can show them on that camera. So she, what is that? Tell us what that is. Frankenstein. Okay, so it's Frankenstein. Look what happens when you open it up. What is that? Is his mouth? Yeah. Does he make sounds? No. Nope. No? Okay. Show him the next one. What is this one? That looks a, a, a Pokeball. Okay. Oh, that's Pikachu. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's this one? A little cute cupcake. A what? A little cute cupcake. Oh, a cute cupcake. All right. Let's see. Oh, it looks like a monster now. <laughs> <Rawr>. All right. <laughs> All right, what's that? Oh, that's a good one. I'm actually very impressed with, with her, her drawing skills. All right, don't worry about that. Here, show them this one. And who is that? A vampire. Is that Dracula or just another vampire? Because he looks um, like he has... Um, I can't tell. You can't tell? Okay. <laughs> okay. Good job. So anyway, she's quite the artist. Um, we... Here, have a seat. When we, when we do e-learning, she can't wait to draw and be creative. So I thought it would only be fun to um, get her involved in a freebie. And that's what we're going to do. So first thing we're going to do, you see this little thing here? What is this? It's a felt pad. Okay, do you know what we're going to do with this? Okay, well, I'll show you. What is this? Ink. That's ink. That's right. So we're going to open up this ink. And, ink. well, you're going to share with me. <laughs> All right, so here's, we're going to, we're going to, uh, practice first on this before we ink this. So take and hold this in your finger like this. Two ink. Yeah, I just gave you two just in case. But put your finger like this. Pretend like you're pushing down on it with your finger in the corner like that. And then pick it up with your other finger so you're holding it like this. Okay, close enough. Now push down real hard and take a look at your ink pad. Is there ink on there? Yeah. Go ahead, press down real hard. You want to get it on the corner. So move your finger up to the corner, right there, there you go. Okay, push down real hard, that's good. Now take it and grab your scrap piece of paper and start going like this, very gently. You've done this with me before. Are you getting ink on there? Let me see, keep going. So here, re-dab it. Here, you know what? Here, I'll push this down for you, grab this one. Put your finger right at the tip of that. Right there, right back here. And then go ahead and you're going to take that and very gently, pay attention to what you're doing, like this, very gently, right against, there you go, okay. Yeah, right against the edge. Okay, here, put your hands up here so they can see you doing it too. Okay, look at me, look how I'm doing it. You're, you're going to take it and just brush the very edge. Good, that's good. Now work all the way around. Don't just do it in one spot the whole time, move it all the way around. Okay, now I'm not seeing any ink on there, so what does that mean maybe? Yeah. That we might need some more? There you go, okay. Push down, good, okay. Right on the edge, you wanna work on the edge, not in the middle, but on the edge. Good, okay. So go ahead, keep doing it. You can do it faster too. Just go a little bit quicker. Okay, and we're just barely, there you go, that looks good. Okay, so now, now that we practiced, we can take our practice pieces out of the way and this little pilgrim hat has what right here? This? Yeah, this thing. What's this? It's like a feather, right? A leaf. A leaf. Okay, sure. It's a leaf. Grab your leaf. You have one too. Press down. Get some more ink on your pad. And we're very gently 
going to ink the very edge of the leaf here. I think it's a feather. If you want it to be a, a leaf, that's fine. Okay, so remember where to put your finger. Are you, are you hitting it with the part that actually has the ink on it? Kind of, okay. If you need, oh, there you go. Okay, you're getting it. Go on. So all we're doing is we're lightly taking this felt pad and hitting the very top and the very edge of, very good, very good, good job. And we're gonna go all the way around. Yep, push down hard to get nice ink in there, yep. <clears throat> and then just work your way all the way around. Because the idea here, for those of you watching, these are intended to be used as little place settings for your Thanksgiving. So we're gonna run out after this and go get some what? What do we gotta get for these? Candy corn. That's right, we're gonna get candy corn. Hopefully, hopefully we make it home before you eat them all, right? Yeah. <laughs> I have to hide them from her, I think. She's a little sugar freak, aren't you? Yeah. So, all right, let me see how you're doing. Good job. Now work your way all the way around. We gotta go all the way around. Okay, so this is optional. You obviously don't have to ink, but if you want to, it will definitely make it look cooler, right? Doesn't it look cooler with ink instead of no ink? Okay, you're doing a really good job, actually. Okay, so let me know when you're done. I'm gonna talk to the people for a minute. Um, so it's a very simple project. We've got this piece here that we're gonna glue this. I still think it's a feather. I don't think it's a leaf. You think it's a leaf, huh? You're doing it. I think it's both. You're doing a really good job here, actually. Put, put it over here so they can see it. Here, let me show them real quick. Look at that inking. That's not bad for her second or third time. Good job. Now try to keep the ink more along the edge. Okay, and not so much in the middle, but it still looks great. You're doing a good job. Okay, so finish up the inking. And while she's finishing that up, um, I'm just gonna go over the pieces here with you guys. So the idea here is, this is the prototype. We have a container, it's gonna be closed up. You can put your little treats in there. It doesn't have to be candy corn, it can be whatever you want. Um, but we do have, it's closed off. And whatever you wanna put in there, it can be overflowing. You could even just put like little chocolate bars or what else, what would you put in here? If you had a choice, if we could go to if we could go to the store right now and get anything you want, what would you put in here? Toys. <laughs> okay, you could do that too for the kids. Put little you know little doodads and trinkets or whatever you want to do. All right, are you almost almost done there? Yeah. Okay, good job. You're doing really good. All right, so let's move this out of the way and grab. Where's your leaf? Your leaf is up here. All right, go ahead and put a little bit of glue on that. We have like five glue bottles here now. All right, just very gentle and try to get a little bit of glue all over the project. Now that's probably a little too much. You see how thin mine is? See how thin mine is? So here's what I'm gonna do. This is what I tell all of our dreamers all the time. I'm gonna flatten this out a little bit with my finger, okay? And get some of that off of there so that it's not so thick because when you're working with thick glue, it makes it tougher. You don't need any more, you're, you got plenty. All right, so now grab that, pick that up. Okay, and we're gonna take this and we're gonna glue it down onto the center of our gold piece. Now, what I would do, make sure that, I would actually leave this on your, on your surface. Okay, make sure you line it up nicely, like I have mine. Yeah, good. Well, okay, go ahead, yeah, perfect, all right. Good, now press down. Okay, good, okay, not bad, now you see how you see how you have a little bit of glue out here? Why do you think that happened? I put too much. That's right, because you put too much on it, but that's okay. Sometimes... I do that score sometimes. I know, that's okay. You're still learning, you're fine. You're doing a really good job. Okay, so we got that done. Now, we need to put the hat together, don't we? Yeah! Yeah, we need to put the hat together. Okay, so let's put this off to the side so we don't mess it up. And we need to get this piece. See this piece? All right, put everything else to the side. We don't need that right now. We just need this piece. And I already folded everything. Do you see how it's folded? All right, what is this called? You know what that's called? Flat. It's called a tab, close. All right, so grab your glue. And we need to put glue on the tab, all on the tab. Right. All right, so, side? well, this side here. Okay, so go ahead and put your glue on that tab, very gentle. All right, that's a lot, but that's okay. Keep moving. Keep moving along. 
Keep going. All right. Good, good, good. Now throw a little bit over here. Okay, that's fine. So here's what I do now. Here, turn it this way. Hold that real quick. Put your glue bottle down. You don't need any more glue. You got tons of glue on there. Hold that. Okay. Now here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take my finger and I'm going to spread that glue. Spread it all the way down like this. Just down to the edge. All the way down to the edge. All the way down to the edge down here. Good. Okay. Other. Other edge too. The whole tab needs to have some glue on it. Okay. So now we need to wipe our hands off, right? Let me just grab a scrap piece of paper. If you have some glue on there, just wipe it off. Just get it off. And then you can go like this with your hands, get all that stuff off of there. All right, now take this tab. You can actually put this down flat. So fold it like that. There you go. Now take this other end and bring it down and drop it right onto that tab. And then make sure it's nice and flat. Now press really hard right there. There you go. Open it up. Okay. There you go. Okay. Look at, we did it. Okay. Almost done. All right. Good job. All right. So now I want you to almost, yeah, you got the right idea here. Do this. Now take these tabs and fold them out. Okay. Fold them out so that it's, well, just take them and fold them out this way. So they're sticking out. We're going to take this piece. That's right. Actually, you are 100% right. So we're going to take this piece and we're going to stick it over this and smush it down. Not hard. Gently. Okay. Now, how are we going to make this stick to this piece? It's floppy <laughs> with glue. Okay. So here, do this. So make sure it's sitting on there nicely. Flip it over. Flip it over. There you go. Okay. So now peel. No, it's not going to stick because we need to put glue on it. It's fine here. So take one tab, pick whichever one you want, do that one and throw a little bit of glue on it. Not a lot. Just like this. Look what I did. Very gentle, not a big mound of glue, just a nice thin line. And you know what? That's probably enough. Okay. So now look what I'm doing. I'm going to pull this up. You're done with the glue. Now you don't need the glue. Now go ahead and let go. Put your glue bottle down now here. Look, so just so it looks like mine, Pull this up, pull that part up. All right. And now take this tab and push it down onto the inside of the brim. That's okay. You got it. Perfect. Now flip it down on the table and push down where, which side did you put the glue on that one right there? Okay. So press down like this, give it a good rub, 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 rub. Okay. Take a look, flip it over. Let's see if it's stuck. It's stuck. Which one was it? This one. That one? Perfect. Okay. Now don't, don't crease it like that. Now leave it like this. Now this one's already glued down. Let's glue down the one that's opposite of the one that we already glued down. This Correct. One? Yes, ma'am. Oh, oh, it's okay. Hey, that's okay. All we need to do is flip this tab in and put some glue on that. Like this? Absolutely. Whatever's easiest for you. That's what I always tell our dreamers. Do what is easy for you. A little thin line of glue, not a lot. Perfect. Go all the way to that side too. Okay. Now to me, just because I do this all the time, that looks like a lot of glue. So here's what you can do. You can just kind of dab it, just smash it like smush, 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 smush. Okay. And then wipe your finger off. So you don't get glue all over the place. And then if you need to rub your finger off so to get all that stuff off. And now bring this up and we're going to push this down on the other side. Just like we did. Correct. You got it. And then just press down. Just don't forget which tab it is. There you go. Good job, girl. Darling, you're doing good. You're doing good, darling. All right. So now what do we, what do you think we should do next? Maybe get the rest of these tabs glued down. My homework. Your homework. <laughs> yeah, no, we're doing videos now. All right. Flip it over. No, flip this over. You're getting ahead of yourself. All right. We still have four more tabs to glue. So, Grab your glue <clears throat> and now because it's anchored on two sides, here's what we we'll do. Watch me real quick. No, no, no. How's that going to stick to this? You got to flip it this way. Otherwise, how is that going to connect here? Watch what I'm doing real quick. You're fine. Watch what I'm doing real quick. Hey, darling, Psst. look, simple line, line real quick. Very, yeah. Okay. Good. Too much, too much. That's fine. 
Go on. All right, next one. Good. All right, now let's go over here. Real quick line, real quick line. You're getting better. That's, that's more than enough. That'll work just fine. And good. All right. Put your glue down. Now take these tabs, flip them down a little bit so that they're closer to the brim of the hat. Yep, just like that. Bring these down. Bring that one down too. All the ones that we put glue on. Just bring them down just a tiny bit. And I'll show you what we do. Now watch. Make sure that halfway down, flip it over. And now push down on all of them. Just let all of them just go around in a circle. There you go. And keep pushing because it takes a few moments for that glue to what? Dry. That's right. <laughs> she cannot sit still. You always have to be standing, don't you? Yeah, okay. Let's see what it looks like now. Look at that. Okay, better. This one is not the greatest, but hey, you know what? It really doesn't matter because it looks great. Okay, so now what do you think we should do? Hide behind the piece of paper. All right. <laughs> All right, flip yours over because we got to put the bottom on, right? Because if we, if we were to put candy in here, what would happen right now? All my candy would fall off. Right, exactly. All right, so flip her over. And now we got to use a lot of glue here, okay? Oh, no. Not a lot, but... I'm going to spray it all over my head. All over your head. All right, grab your glue. Now watch what I'm doing. I'm doing a curly cue. I'm making like a pig's tail all the way around. Yeah, a long pig tail. That's, that's a very long pig tail, that's right. Okay. So do a little pig tail. Okay, they're doing good. Good. While she's doing that, just to make this nice and crisp and clean, you want to make sure that you get, so, you get enough glue out there. And if you want to, you can take your finger and rub that glue all the way out to the very edge. Okay, that's a lot of glue. That's okay, though. Yours will definitely stick for a long time. Okay. I keep mine. Okay, that's fine. All right, you got a lot of glue there, so take some of that and spread it off over there. Okay, so now, once you're done with that, wipe your finger off. Now take this piece, and we're going to pop it right on top of this. We have to make sure that we get it nice and even so it lines up with the other piece. There you go. Make sure you don't have glue on your fingers. And you're going to... Oh, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Just do your best. That's all you can do. Okay. Now it's kind of like you're, you've never made a pie. Make sure that you got to keep your eyes on the project though. Otherwise it's going to be messy. You need to focus. That's one of the biggest things you can do. So press that down to make sure that it's all making good contact. Okay. And then if you want, you can flip it over. I even got some glue on mine. I'm a little distracted because I have someone else in the studio today. Do you know who that is? Well, you'll see. We're about to do that. Let me see how yours looks. Hey, that is not too bad. All right. Good job. Okay. Yeah. Look at, see, you're already jumping ahead. Now we're going to take this. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you goof. All right. So we're going to take this. What do you think we do with this? Uh huh. But we have to glue it. Well, obviously we have to glue it. So here, do this. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to do what's called anchoring. Okay. Um, kind of, but it's not going to stay though. Here. And we're going to start by putting glue on this part where the, where, where the buckle is. Okay. Buck. The what? I'm buckle my seatbelt. You're going to buckle your seatbelt? <laughs> okay. So we just put our glue there. Let's start on that. That's probably, yeah, keep going a little bit more. Try to get it out to right here too. That's good. <clears throat> okay. So now, well, wipe it off on the thing. Just wipe it off on your screen. You can do that too. Wipe your fingers off though. Make sure you don't have glue all over it. So we're going to take this. Oh, my hand's going to be a part of it. It could be. Now take a look here. You see on this hat, you see these little lines here? All right. For those of you following along with us, there are some lines there that, now make sure you're putting it on the right way. The bottom of this band lines up with the little lines on the hat. And technically the bottom of the buckle should be flush with the bottom of the hat. Okay, so let's just get that part on there. Good. Make sure it's nice and flat at the bottom and push and just hold this down. There's no glue on here, so you don't need to worry about that. Push on that area there. Okay, okay now we're done. Bye. Almost. <laughs> Not quite. Okay, so we got that. 
Now what do you think we need to do? Well, we're all done. No, not quite, because look at this is kind of a floppy hat. So here. It's so, perfect. It's perfect. So here, pull this back. And actually, this side here, with this additional tab, we need to do this side first. So find the side, no, find the side with the additional tiny little tab. You see this tiny little tab? We're gonna start by gluing this side first. Okay, we're gonna throw some glue on there, all the way down to the end, like that. Piggy tail. Uh, you could do a pigtail if you'd like, yes, that's fine. So the side here with the smaller little tab is the side we need to glue down first. So okay. bring it. Oh, my candy is going to fall out. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, so you got that side glued down. All right, so now you want to take and put glue on the other side here, on the other section of the little band. All the way like that. And then we're going to take this and fold it over. Wait for me. And connect it to the other end. It should sit right on top of that other section that had that little bonus little tab there. Good job. You're getting way better with the glue now. You still have a lot of glue on there though. Done. No, not quite. You got to bring it, but here, you know what? Yeah, Maybe, good. yeah, it's pretty good. Put yes. that down and take, well, yeah, see that's a lot of glue there. Wipe some of that off real quick. Off your finger. Get it off your finger. Wipe it off. And spread that out really nice. I know, it's hard, huh? But it's not once you get used to it. Here, let me help you real quick. Let me get some of this off there. Let's get that off there. <laughs> all right, go ahead and pull it all the way around, just like mine. Uh-oh. What happened? No, it didn't, you didn't match it up. You got to pull it all the way. You got to pull it nice and tight. Mm. You made a little bit of a mess there. So here. When you have extra glue like that on there, just wipe some of it off, okay? You got way too much glue on there. It's okay though, That's darling. Cool. Yeah, all right, so pretty close. Not bad for a first timer. Okay, so what's left? We just have to put our little buckle and feather on, and it's gonna go like this, okay? But here's the thing. We only need to put glue on this section here, okay? So go ahead and throw a little bit of glue just around the square part of the buckle. Mm, too much. All right, well, don't squeeze as hard. And then if you do too much, you can stop, put the glue bottle down, and then spread it around with your finger to make it thinner so it's not that. so thick. I'm going to do that. That looks great. Okay, good. Yep. And then make sure you wipe your finger off before you start applying it to the actual project so you don't get glue all over the place and then we just need to and I don't get my finger glued today. that's true too and then we just glue that right on right onto the square part get it right on there oh good job and then press and hold it in place and just keep you have to be patient because where's my name on it your name on it oh well that's the prototype but we can you can write your name on it afterwards Yay. Yay. and well that was probably um, a little bit longer of a freebie tutorial than usual. But the reason that I wanted to do this is because, I mean, with everything going on in the world as far as Corona um, and with fall coming, I have a feeling that... I got glue on me. That's okay. Oh, that's fine. It still looks great. It's your first project and you got glue all over your fingers. With, mm -hmm. with all the stuff going on, um, we're always looking for new ways to keep the kids entertained. And I, I really do think that this is a great way to help with um, hand-eye coordination, dexterity, focus, things of that nature. And plus, you get to spend some quality time with your kids. So I think that's it now. What do we gotta go do now? Eat candy. Well, we have to go buy candy so I can take photos. No, I'm gonna eat all of it. Why, why are you looking at yourself? <clears throat> But that's it. Now, if you guys want to, obviously with this little feather or leaf, whatever you want to call it, you can do like a print and cut and put people's names on it. Or we're probably just going to write them in. No big deal. And, um, and that's pretty much it. So 
Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please take a moment and visit our YouTube channel and hit that subscribe button. And while you're there, hit the little uh, bell so that you get notifications anytime we release and a new product. And hit the picture of me. <laughs> <clears throat> and if you make this or anything from our uh, thankful bundle, I would love to see it. And so would the 23,000 plus other dreamers that inspire us daily. So head on over to your Facebook and do a search for Dreaming Tree Group. And, uh, or you can just type in this little URL that's going to pop up. URL. At the bottom of a URL. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it means. Uh, actually, I do know what it means. Relative link something. Anyway, um, but anyway, I. I got my own. There you go. It looks pretty good, right? <laughs> it's pretty good. So anyway, if she can do it, anybody can do it. Definitely hope you get your kids involved. Uh, hope everyone's having a wonderful fall. And Can't see me. <laughs> And I hope that you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And as always, I look forward to what? Eating candy. <laughs> Crafting with you again.